This is one crayon. This is five crayons. This is a hundred crayons. And this is a thousand crayons! I've made a mess. Thanks to Best Fiend Stars for sponsoring this video. Hey guys, it's Wenji and Crayon Hugs! So today I'll be melting all my crayons into giant crayons. Ready guys? Let's go! So a while back I decided to buy a bunch of crayons because I wanted to cut through them with a hot knife. If you guys remember the video, I'm going to play it right now for you guys. So I didn't use all my crayons for that video, so I've been carrying so many crayons with me. I've moved from place to place and I've been bringing these crayons with me and I haven't known what to do with them. So I decided why not melt all my crayons into giant crayons. This is a dangerous spot, guys. Oh, guys, I think that was the final one. I'm gonna call this creation Crayon Mountain. I've made a big mistake. I actually wanted to sort the colors out to make my giant crayons certain colors. And you know what, guys? I have to peel all of these. Why did I even think of that when I decided to do this? I have to peel 10,000 crayons? Guess I'm not doing anything else tonight. So you guys know I love Best Fiends. But guys, super exciting news. Best Fiends has released a cool new game called Best Fiends Stars. It's super addictive. And you guys can download it for free right now. Just like the original, you can collect a ton of cute characters as you match and blast your way through various puzzles. And the coolest thing is you can also team up with your friends and family in Best Fiend Stars. So I just started playing recently and I think I'm doing really well. When I match a super long combination, it is so satisfying. Like seriously, this is why this game is so addictive. There's also a ton of magical boosters in the game where it helps you get more points and destroy more enemies. And you can get amazing treasures and rewards for completing certain tasks and puzzles. And the characters are super adorable. I love collecting them all. And guys, the coolest thing is you guys are the first to know that Best Fiend Stars is launching. So be the first to level up. And guys, let me know down below what level you're on and whether you're beating me or not. And if you haven't started playing yet, don't forget to download it. See if you can beat my level. When G can I play too? Ooh, a lizard wizard. This will be super easy. Who can I eat those? Oh. Oh no. When G I will require help. Hey, there's a murdy. Come back here, birdie. Watch this epic combo, Wenji. This is gonna be good. Wait for it. Here it comes. Time for my finishing move. Be gone. I love this game. I actually want to make giant usable crayons. So instead of mixing all the colors together, in which case it'd probably be brown or black, I'm going to be picking five of my favorite colors to make crayons out of. So these are the five colors I'm going to mix. And you know what? Because we're making our own crayons, let's do some custom colors. I'm going to mix some white with the blue and we're going to make a nice lighter purple and a nice lighter blue. So I've created this crayon mountain and it wasn't easy because they kept sliding off and falling falling out so I've created a little fortress of things around this crayon mountain we got the boxes we got some pencil boxes oh see dangerous and the one last thing I'm using to block this crayon mountain is my own body as you can see I'm now attached to the table because if I move I, I really don't know what's gonna happen all right time to peel <laughs> One. Yellow. And then putting it in. Oh, wrong purple. There's two types of purples? Oh no. Yeah, what you doing? Peeling crayons. How's it going? I did five. What are you doing? Peeling crayons. How is it? I've done seven. What? How was what? What are you doing? Healing crayons. You know that by now. How many you done? Oh, not bad. Eight 
<laughs> Are you washing your crayons? I found a hack! Look, you put it in hot water, look, it just comes off. Oh! Yeah, 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 yeah. see? That one's done. Oh! Wait, 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 look, wait, 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 wait. So you just like swish them around, and it only takes like, sometimes like 30 seconds. See, this just comes off like that. Oh, look, 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 look. These are all off. It's magic! I see the light, guys. I will be peeling crayons for the whole week. Alright guys, so we've finished all the peeling. Finally, it's been a very long time. It's been a whole day. And you know what? To be honest guys, this doesn't look like a lot, but it is. This is my hand. This is how many crayons we have. It feels like a massage. This feels really good. Alright guys, so my first challenge was what should I use as a mold to make a giant crayon? So I had to think about it and I was eating my favorite snack and it occurred to me, we gonna be using some Pringles cans. So I have five of these Pringles cans that we're going to use to make five different colored crayons. I also did a little makeshift oiler which is literally like a fork and some paper towel that I like elasticized. And then you just kind of brush the oil. Hopefully it doesn't stick. Otherwise, worst case, we're going to have to cut these open. So now it's time to melt the crayons. I have prepared an electric stove. So we're going to pop that down in a pot. Alright, so the first color is going to be purple and I'm going to mix it with some white to make a nice light purple. Let's see how light you'll get. Alright, we're going to put in some purple. Adding some white. Alright, that looks about right. Alright guys, I'm going to turn it on. I'm going to put it on low heat because the crayons melt so quickly. Oh my gosh, guys, this is crazy. All right, guys, we're on to the next color. Let's do pink. So we have a new assistant with us today, meet Boomba, Hi. at Boomba Munchkin. He really wanted me to promote his Instagram. But anyways, it's been a few days. The actual crayons have dried. I've even done my hair. I'm super productive. And uh, we're gonna get these out of the cans. I hope the oil has worked and it isn't sticking. That would mean I spent too many hours on this and have no actual result. But anyways, let's cut it open. You gonna help? 
You're, you're not you're not here to sleep. Guess I'm doing it by myself. And now it's time to give Bomba a haircut. Just kidding. I'm gonna use scissors to cut the rim because it's thick like Bomba's butt. So after you get to the actual crayon part, it's actually really hard to cut with scissors because you can't get in there. So I'm gonna use a blade. Don't do this at home, guys. It's very dangerous. Get parental supervision. Even though I'm an adult, I'm still scared. I'm also scared to cut into the crayon and ruin my beautiful piece of art. Okay, guys, I've cut the whole way through and hopefully I haven't cut any of the crayon. I'm gonna peel it. Oh. Oh. Oh no! Is it stuck? No, the oil didn't work. All right guys, so the oil didn't work very, very well, but it's actually all right. So when I'm peeling it, it's coming off. So I guess I'm gonna have to peel all the way around. Ooh, it's looking promising, right Boomba? You're showing me a Boomba. Oh, that's so satisfying. We are finally done. Oh guys, look, look, look. What is that? It's like a little weird kaleidoscope pattern on the bottom. I don't even know what it's made up of. It's like a skin disease. Skin disease. So anyways, this is our first giant crayon. I actually really like this. This is so adorable. Let me compare it to a normal size crayon. All right, so this is a normal crayon. This is my giant crayon. Okay, the size difference is crazy. So let's peel the rest and I'll come back to you guys with all of them done. Oh, the oil worked in this one. Okay guys, this is really, really satisfying. Wait, 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 watch this. Oh! Look how clean, oh my God, it is so smooth. Anyways, we are done. This was the final crayon. Let's bring all of them in. Look guys, we have made our giant crayons. They're so cute. They kind of look stubby because of the shape. This is nice and thin and elegant. They're stubby. Kind of like Mia. All right, Mia, who's taller? You are the crayon. So let's see. Mia, what do you think of these crayons? Are they cute? Cute like you? Nothing is as cute as me when G. Hmm. So guys, I was going to actually shave the top to make it like the crayon shape, that little triangle on the top. Then I thought to myself, you know what? That would be such a huge waste of crayons. I don't want to waste crayons. You know what we want to do with crayons? Draw with them. This is really hard to draw with. No, 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 I can do better. I can do better. I know what I'm gonna draw. What am I drawing? You crazy person. <laughs> Why do you have wheels for feet? <laughs> <laughs> what is this? Your car? Oh, you can't fit it. <laughs> I couldn't tell! You know, my empire found your flowers and leaves on it. And your fans can draw better than you. They're not using giant crayons! Alright guys, let me know how I did with these DIY giant crayons. Also, don't forget to check out Best Fiend stars and see if you can beat my level. I've left a link in the description box below, so don't forget to check it out and tell me what level you're on. Alright guys, I'll see you guys next week with a new video. Bye! Love you! Mwah.